what we've just introduced is the threat track and that includes now automatic weather threat assessment functions that actually look inside of individual thunderstorms and analyze the structure inside to determine is that cell going to produce lightning, hail, is it going to be particularly severe, is it growing. What's neat about this system, we've always had multi-scan that is very good at detecting weather systems and telling us what's going to happen. There's three or four really neat features here. Predictive overflight, two level of turbulence detections, both severe and what we call passenger comfort, as well as then hail, lightning, and thunderstorms. And so there's three predictive capabilities in there to give the pilot the confidence to know how to traverse and work through weather systems in ways they hadn't before. Dynamically and tactically, we, we always have to use the weather radar if we see anything to make a decision, are we gonna go near it or do we have to go around it? With the threat track radar, if the threat track radar indicates that we don't need to take an excessive deviation, then obviously we're gonna take a much shorter route. We save a lot of fuel, it reduces carbon emissions into the atmosphere. All the things today that American Airlines wants to do to be a good neighbor.